So with the rise of social media, there's this need for an endless flow of video content. Video content's very engaging on social media, and it's something that your small business needs to be competitive. Problem is, what type of video content do you create? Well, here's 16 ideas to get you started. Idea number one is a brand video. A brand video is like your company video. It tells your story, talks about your mission, talks about your why, maybe what makes you different. If somebody were to ask you, hey, what's your company's mission? and what makes you different, what would you tell them, right? What would be your two or three minute sales pitch on that? Take that, make it your script and create a video around it. Idea number two is a meet the team video. A meet the team video is a good video in your sales process. Maybe your sales people can send that out to say, hey, here's the team that's gonna be working on your project or doing X, Y, Z for you. Get to know them a little bit better. Could also be a video you send to new customers. Hey, we really are excited to get started. I'm gonna send you a video so you can get to know the team a little better. This is a great video to just kind of showcase your staff, the value that they bring, how do they fit in the process and what makes them different. Idea number three is a product demo video. If you sell products, really this video is explaining those products. It's the how-to around the product. If somebody were to ask you, hey, tell me about your product, how it works, and really why I should buy it, what would you say to them? Turn that into a script and make a video around it. Idea number four is a service video. It's a service explainer video, really, talking about the process and the value behind the service that you provide. This is a great video on the sales process to put on your website, to post on social media. If somebody uh, is interested in your services, this would be the video that would really help them pull the trigger on that because it explains to them the value of your service, really the quality behind it, the process behind it, so they're comfortable and ready to move forward. Idea number five is a sales presentation video. Really, it's the uh, overview of your company and the products that you provide. It's something that your salespeople might want to show in a sales meeting or in a presentation. It could be something they want to send their prospects prior to signing up to get them excited. Just think about what's the best video to sell your company and the products and services that you provide in a real short and sweet little two-minute script. Create a video around that. Idea number six is to create commercials for your brand. Think of a short, inspiring, maybe funny commercials, short explainer video type commercials, stuff that you can put on social media, you can put on your YouTube channel, you could potentially even run on digital TV. It's a short ad, right, about your business. It doesn't have to be too detailed, right? If you think about commercials for BMW or Under Armour and these sorts of things, it's sometimes just an inspiring story with their logo at the end. That works too. So think about the types of commercials you can create around your brand. Idea number seven is to create snackable content. Snackable content is very short video content you could put on social media. It's just snackable content. It could be fun. It could just be a short animation with a statement on there. It could be uh, something funny like somebody dancing through the streets, right, with a short tagline on it. Think of these as animated banner ads, essentially. Create a lot of videos around this. Snackable content you can continually share across social media. Idea number eight is to create weekly tip videos, maybe even monthly tip videos if you don't have a lot of time. But the tip videos really are the ideas around how your product or service can solve problems, right? And the tips around that. Think of these as educational. You have a lot of knowledge and, uh, and industry knowledge you know, from where you come from. How do you share that, right? How do you become a thought leader in your space? Tip videos work really well for that. A perfect example is the one I'm doing right now. How can you make a tip video like the one I'm doing right now for your business? Idea number nine is to do some webinars or some podcasts and record the podcast. Here again, it's like the tip video idea, but this is a little more longer form content where you really dive into something in particular that you're an expert around. Create content around that, whether it's a webinar or a podcast, record that and get that up on uh, social media and on your YouTube channel. Idea number 10 is customer stories. Find some of your best customers and create a short customer story around that customer, right? These are like video testimonials, essentially. It shows how these customers are succeeding by using your products or services and how they're so happy about it, right? That's gonna get people excited to wanna do business with you in the future. Idea 11 is user-generated content. By this, I mean have your customers actually send you content, maybe uh, videos of the products that they purchased from you, or maybe a short testimonial video that they just recorded on their phone and send it over. Give them a gift card, right? Thank them for this kind of stuff. You know, Give them a reason to do it, and then share that on social media and post that on your website. This kind of content's really good because it feels authentic. It's not something that you created and you sent a whole video crew to go do. It's somebody that, uh, 
somebody that felt compelled to do this video content on their own and you're just simply sharing that on social media. Idea number 12 is to do project videos. This can be like a before after video or a design reel or a, uh, a, an annual uh, project reel of sorts where you really highlight case studies and projects that you've done in the past um, so that people can see that you do a good job and there's actually results that come from it. Idea number 13 is training videos or uh, help videos. So if there's additional uh, instructions that need to be provided for the products or the services that you offer, maybe you provide a service and there's some sort of uh, maintenance or management of that service needed after the fact, think about the things that your customers might need additional training or support on in the form sort of, of help documentation where you can create this type of content uh, for your website, your help site, for your social media channels, your YouTube channels, et cetera. Idea number 14 is a company culture video. Think of this like a recruiting video. If somebody's interested in working for you, they want to kind of see behind the scenes of what your company's like. What's the culture like? What does it look like? What's the work environment? How do people interact? You know, what's the day-to-day -day look like? Create a video around that. It's going to be a great asset you can put on your apply page. Idea number 15 is an employee spotlight video. Maybe uh, take uh, somebody that's been with you for five years or 10 years and, and put them on the calendar to do an employee spotlight video, right? Highlight their story. What were they doing before they worked for you, right? What uh, has their experience been like? What's some things in their life that they're interested in outside of work, right? Tell their story and what they're passionate about. This will fuel their fire, but it's also good content to kind of leverage behind the recruiting video where you can start to highlight some of your staff as well and show people that are interested in working for you that there's some pretty cool people that work for you also that are pretty happy. And idea 16, last idea, do an annual party for your company and show a video at the party. Get them excited, right? This is a great time to kind of schedule an annual refresh of your company video, your inspiring message that not only really fuels up your team, but also can be used on your website and on social media to get your customers and potential customers excited about you as well. It stays relevant that way. Because if you do a company video and then don't update it for like five years, it gets kind of stale, right? So if you do this every year, it always stays fresh and relevant. And it's really something exciting to show at your company party. So that's it, thanks for watching. There's 16 tips to get you started and good ideas around video for your company. If you have additional ideas for video or tips around video for small business, please leave it in the comments. Like the video if you liked it, share it with your friends and follow us for more content like this down the road. Happy marketing.